Hey guys, this is Dr. Hub. In case you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe. This is a concise, well-crafted summary and it highlights only the important keywords. Regulation of respiration. And here we'll look at the pond time respiratory centers as well as the cerebral cortex. So to continue with the previous one, the medullary lesions, they can lead to various type of breathing patterns. And these breathing patterns, it can include the cluster breathing, the taxing breathing, that is the biots breathing as well as the chain strokes breathing, respiration, as well as the pneumotaxic, as well as the gasping. Now moving on to the pontine respiratory centers, there is something known as a pneumatic center. A pneumatic center is nothing but in the lower ponds. It stimulates uh, inspiration and it produces deep as well as prolonged. So deep and prolonged inspiratory gasps. The pneumatoxic center it tonically inhibits it. Next moving on to the pneumotaxic center. The pneumotaxic center is located in the nucleus paradonchialis medialis and in the colica fuse nucleus in the rostral bones. It coordinates the respiration by switching between the inspiration as well as the expiration. Then moving on to the cerebral cortex. It controls the voluntary components of breathing. That is a person can voluntarily hold breath so they can hold the breath or they can do hyperventilation. 